Don, Don Ken is going ham with this one. Turn it up. Finally famous volume three. The cannon. The cannon. Big yeah. Sean. October song. Right. Ayo Drizzy, let's go uh, get him. The, the, uh, the, the, yeah. yeah. Uh, low key Peter Parker flow. Tell her bring some ace of spade, no sparklers though. Private flights, no hassle, I just park and go. I'm the highlight. Like when markers glow, ooh, look what you created. Only got yourself to blame. I remember when you hated, ooh. Now you tell me take my time. How about I just take your city and make that motherfucker mine? Booby, you know, backstage up Howard University for the Big Sean Walker Flocker Show. Shout out to my homie Hannibal. You know I'm right here live on Stamp TV. Shit don't stop, people do. Oi. from Howard Homecoming last year. Now, congratulations, brother. Thank you. Flock of Feli. Yeah, hitting heart, the top man. of the Billboard charts. Yeah, man. Yeah, you're doing it. I'm trying to go hard, right, man. Ain't nothing but success, man. Four singles off my album. One single almost went triple platinum, went double so far. <coughs> so kind of good. Now, you gave it a great performance. Yeah. It's my boy, Big Song, man. You know you got so big love, man. It's a big song. And now, you, you have you seen on World Star Hip Hop the video of the little boy rocking out to when he was sleeping. I ain't get to see it. You ain't see it yet? Everybody, everybody be telling me about it. Now I'm gonna go look it up, man. You gotta go check it out. So now with that happening, do you consider yourself a role model to young kids? Yes, man. I'm, I'm, I'm doing a lot better here, like in public, you know what I'm saying? I see a lot of kids looking up to me, so I gotta get it. Man, walk a flock and stamp that, man.
Man, I was made for the shine, shine, shine. Girl Aisha, and of course, you know, Stamp bring you all those exclusive interviews. Oh, yeah. Your boy, Big Sean. What's How up? you doing, brother? What's up, man? What's good? Sean, you know, I just got done seeing you make basically Howard go bananas. Y'all obviously will know and see on the footage. So how has life been? Finally famous. <laughs> man, it's been crazy. You know, shout out to Howard, too, man. You guys really put it down like some G's. Made my job easy, man. All I had to do was just go out there and do what I do. You know what I'm saying? And uh, like Waka Flocka was a good-ass surprise, right? Yeah, and um, I have fun, man. And I forgot the question. What was the question? <laughs> uh -huh. No, I was just asking you how you were doing. But we could jump right into the questioning, you know. We would start with the meat and potatoes of that. So, Finally Famous, you know, people have been waiting for this. You had three mixtapes. The album coming up, when is, is June it? Can we expect it? Can we say it? Can we stamp that? It's official. Yeah, no more pushbacks, man. It was supposed to come in May, but I wasn't ready. It was my bad. It wasn't even a label or nothing, so... June, it is what it is. June 21st, you're gonna get it. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, it, it's a long time coming, man. Like, just to see the progression and to see the growth that keeps going up and up and up. And it's all because real G's listen and take the time out. You know, it's hard as hell to get to, for, to cat, latch on to a new artist. If you honestly think about it, man, and I work, I work my ass off, man, from the west side of Detroit all the way to here, man. People don't get to do shit like this, you know. And people don't get to see the world and do what they love to do. And, you know, I talk a lot of shit like I'm, you know, bragging this and that, but I'm honestly the most humble person, man. And I think anybody who fucks with me, even if you don't buy my shit, even if you just hear it, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. Yeah, because you have a lot of people, you know, coming in for this album. Can you give us kind of some? some hints on who who you've locked in because i know at first there was like a laundry list and i'm sure you've kind of had to cut back and cut down and switch some things up yeah we got a few people on there you know the homie pharrell yay you know common people like that just to throw a few names out there <laughs> but it's, it's mainly me though it tells the story of a kid who found out what he wanted to do in life you know when it, people telling him not to he did the shit anyway falls in and out of love goes through domestic love you know the real shit and uh gets high off life you like that high off life <laughs> and just you know it's just something people can live to, ride to, smoke to, whatever you do. So it's, it is, it's going to be a hell of an album, you know, and I, I just want people to take it as it is, man. And now you said, you know, a long journey. I'm going to I'm gonna ask you to pull your memory back to the, um, 2007 when you basically met up with Kanye. And do you remember what those verses were that kind of grabbed his attention? Because I know you freestyled for him and that's kind of what it was. You know, he heard you basically just off the dome and was like yo this dude is crazy yeah no i don't remember the verses i remember like a couple lines i remember i said something about none of valley that some dally and i make her feel good like hallie effing with me is a mistake like big smalls going to cali it's big with ferocious bars i come hard every time like a porno star and then some other stuff it wasn't all that good back then but I guess he saw the potential more than anything, you know? And he worked me, man. He worked me hard as hell, like, in the studio. I would do songs, and he would tell me, like, man, this shit's not good enough. It's not good enough, you know? And I had to really earn his respect. And now he'd be like, man, it's super good. You're about to be the greatest, you know? Like, right, so he, you were that piece of coal, and he basically put that pressure on you, made you that diamond. Put that pressure on me, man. Boy, you, got, you don't know half of the story, man. Definitely. Pause, no homo and shit. But he definitely put that pressure on me, so we can expect that, you know, Big Brother track like Kanye did for Jay-Z coming with you, you know, when you're, you know, multi-platinum. Yeah, maybe in a couple of albums down, you know, when, it, when it's time for that, you know. Well, we appreciate you being here with Stamp today. Yeah, you already know what it is, man. It's Big Sean, good music, finally famous. I'm chilling with Stamp. It's official, you already know what it is, boy. Yeah. Roth and Big Sean, we are finally famous. Yeah, now roll ten of them up. Fuck the rules, we and the ends, press so bending them up. Don't give a fuck. 
Word to your daddy, leather sandals. Either pay the light bill or light up Ship them the candles. Regular white owl, cigarello, no flavors. Break that bitch down and peel off the first layer. Smooth, like a baby's ass. Mercedes passing, ladies ass, can they be next? Cause I'm kicking they favorite raps. Life is playing 2K and kicking raps all day by the lake. Smoking tree till I collapse in broad day. I'm surfing, radical, gnarly, far out. My stoner chicks gather round soon as I break the jar. Out. Hey baby girl, pass the blizzard Your woman chose me, so I had to jizz her Don't be sleeping or taking no cat naps We leaders of the new school with these fat raps, nigga